you uh, just turned in. How was it this time? I think easy. Hopefully. Good. Hopefully. Hopefully. Easy. Okay. It wasn't a lot. Of so let's do two of them. Okay. Uh, so the first one is kind of right 2413 in S4. Um, as two different products. of transpositions. Uh, there are many, many, many different ways of doing it, or have the answer, but I'll tell you how I do it. Okay. So basically, we start with uh, 2, 4, 1, 3. And to be lazy, I'm just going to write 2, 4, 1, 3. Uh, it's almost like kind of we're trying to do reverse, swap two at a time, to see how we can get back to 1, 2, 3. So if I Swap three and four. Make sense? And then I swap one three again. And then finally I swap one two again. Then what they basically said is uh two four one three is equal to starting with one, two, three, four, and then you apply one, two, one, three, and then three, four. So generally we don't write this because we consider that to be the identity element. So it's basically this. Uh, another way is uh, you swap one, two, And then you swap two and four. And then finally, you swap three and four. So therefore, another way to do it is two, four, and three, four. Any questions so far? Okay. So then let's do another homework which is homework 3. Uh, write all elements of S3 as products, as a product of these join cycles. First of all, let's kind of write down all the, all the elements of S3. 1, 2, 3. 1, 3, 2. 2, 1, 3. 2, 3, 1. For those who's been in this circle for many years, what do we call this order? Um, permutative order? What's that? Permutative order? That would be my guess. <laughs> Permutations. Oh. Oh, wait, I don't know. Oh, no, 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 no. Start with L. G. Uh, X. Lexicographic. Yeah. Lexicographic. Lexicograph. <laughs> so, one, two, three. I'll do the first one for you. One, two, three. The, the way to write it as a disjoint cycle. This is actually might be the hardest one. I didn't write all three. I didn't write. We have to write all three elements. But I didn't write for the one. No, but it's in, because you have to write as the destroying cycle. And the only destroying cycle to not move it is kind of one, two, three. Uh, this one is probably easier. What is this one? One, and then two, three, three. With parenthesis, please. <laughs> parenthesis one, closing parenthesis. Okay. Opening parenthesis two, three, closing parenthesis. Okay, just Wait. making sure we have no misunderstanding. Did you have to write the one? Because I didn't. Yeah. Yes, you have. Can we get that homework? <laughs> <laughs> so what about this one? Isaac, what about this one? Uh, it's one, two, and then three. Okay, you have the hands just just uh, so I think. Open parentheses, one, two, close parentheses. Okay. And then three. What about this one? Two, 
two, three, one. Okay. Uh, we generally prefer this order. One, two, three. No, oh. it doesn't go to two. Uh, so what this means is one would map to two. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on a second. I vote for one and two. I actually I totally agree with you. Oh, there has to be some misunderstanding. Yes. What is it again? Two. One, three, two. What? I should say cycles. No, one, no one, two, three. No, because one, you want one map to two. Two, one, three. Two map to three. What? And then three map to one. But it would be right if you search around the order of those three numbers, right? Oh, actually, it's this one, two, three. Okay. You basically, what this means is um, you always want to arrange so that uh, the number ones go first. But it basically means cycle. Uh, one will go to two, two will go to three, three will go to one. But then, but then that would give you three, one, three, one, two. Because from one to three, so for one to three, one goes into two. So the first number is two. Then the second number is two, but that turns into three. So Remember this notation. What it means is, let's say there's a permutation. The, the notation is such that the first one is uh, one. whatever the element is, the initial element is. So it's basically cycling here until you get back to that end. Uh, next one. What about we... Wait, wait. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three will be the same as this one. Okay. <clears throat> one, three, two. So uh, let's actually... Try it. One, two, three. So what we want is one will match to three. One will match to three. Three will match to two. Two will match to one. Remember, it's cyclic. It's cyclic. It's kind of rotating in one direction. So what this means? One, three, 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 two is one will match to three. Three will match to two. Two will match to one. What this means is one will map to two, two will map to three, three will map to one. Is it, this is what the cycle notation means. One goes to three, four. Three goes to three. Can you show it off by one, three, two, three, two, three? Yeah. So, um, no, 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 this is just straight up the example. This one? Yeah. Okay. Can you so, just repeat what you just did? Yeah. Um, so, initially, you have this notation. Uh, let's say this is the, the number. What this means is you map 1 into 3. 3 map to 2. 2 map to 1. Now, if it is a, a cycle in S5, 4 and 5 doesn't appear here, so these two are untouched. Okay. If I give another example, let's say uh, it's in S5. Okay. If we have a cycle, Call one, let's say, two, four, five. What it does is, so I'm giving an example of this notation. So let's say one, two, four, five. What it, uh, actually, let me make it not uh, in the same order. Let's say one, one, two, five, four. What it means is one will go to two, two will go to five, 5 would go to 4, and then 4 would go to 1. Because 3 doesn't show up, so it's the same. So the last one here, I think this one is simpler, because 2 doesn't move, move so keep 2. And then 1, 3 swap, you can write 1, 3, or 3, or 3 1. Okay. So I think, uh, I, I suspect, what confused some of you is, because this is uh, the cycle containing every single element, if we were, let's say we are talking about S5, 
you will basically think a little bit more about what the cycle notation means versus its uh, actual order of the elements. Can I request that you only take one point off? <laughs> yes. <Or not? laughs> For missing this, like one? For missing one? every, yeah. Okay. Cool.